Okay. Um, when you get your fire stick, you're going to want to hook up to your network, your Wi-Fi or internet or whatever you got. Um, you can go over. I'm using the I'm using the little circular arrow keys. They have up, down, left, right. They're not physical keys. It's just the top of the circle is up, the bottom of the circle is down, the right of the circle and left of the circle, yada yada. The center of the circle is your enter button or select or whatever. OK. Press OK. That would be the center button. Um, so home button gets you at this page right here. It looks like a little house. Um, anyway, at the very top it says home, your videos, search movies, TV shows, app settings, you are going to want to um, go over to settings and verify that your network is connected. Right now I'm connected to mine. If you can't find your network, go down to see all networks, click on that, and you should be able to find your network, whatever it's called. You'll click on it, punch in the password and then there you go you're done um, you'll have to have an Amazon account you'll log into it it'll say uh, register my device whenever you get it uh, you're gonna register it and then you're gonna go into Wi-Fi settings and log in once that's all done it'll bring you to this page this is your home screen right now all of the apps are right here I have Cody YouTube, Mobdro, Showbox, uh, Netflix, um, Aptio TV is actually an app store. It's basically like an Android app store. You can download any kind of app for the Fire Stick and it's a really great thing. It's awesome. Uh, if you don't see these apps right here in the first, you know, five or six apps, go all the way to the right. Click on Select All or See All. And then you can go down here and you can find whatever you're looking for. And if you're looking for Fox News, if you wanted Fox News, hold this OK button up for a little while until it gives you a little message or whatever. Then you'll put it wherever you want it, click it again, drop it, and that's done. Click home. Now Fox News is up here right here okay so we have Cody we have Mobdro and we have Showbox those are the three things Showbox is movies um, I'll show you how to get to that here in a little bit Mobdro is going to be your live television that's live TV uh, every every channel imaginable all kinds uh, I'll go over that here in a little bit let's jump into Cody you're gonna launch Cody and it's going to pull you up to this screen right here. I don't do a big build because it slows down Cody and Cody's already slow enough as it is. So uh, you may have seen fire sticks are all fancy and everything else. I leave mine very simple because it's less things to go wrong. This is exactly what you need. It's the same thing that they use. It's just they go about it, getting it a different way anyway. Uh, go down to Neptune Rising or Placenta. It doesn't matter. I use Neptune Rising personally. been using it for about six, six to eight months. Works great. Just click on that. And you're going to have movies, TV shows, and that is the two. Those two right there are the only two I use. I don't know anything about top movies and playlists and Creator Corner and all that goofy shit. I don't know anything about it. So if you want to watch a movie click on movies. If you want to watch a TV show, click on TV shows. This has every TV show that I've ever seen. It's got Gunsmoke. It's got Rifleman. It's got, it's got anything. Anything you want to watch. So, say for instance, you want to watch a movie. If you wanted to watch uh, Escape from Alcatraz, go down to search, click search, and then we're going to type in Escape.
All right, I'm gonna do escape from. Surely they'll find something. Sometimes if you're not exact on words, uh, you can't find anything. There's Escape from Alcatraz right there. If you want to watch that movie, 1979, click on the movie. Give it a second. It may look like you didn't do anything. Just give it a second. It's going to look for streams to watch it from. Um, if you're... If you're at your house and you've got fiber optic or you have uh, uh, like cable modem, I would you can probably watch 1080. If not, I would go with uh, HD. And then SD is not bad on a smaller TV. I'd say 55 inches and lower. You'd probably get away with SD. The higher the quality, the more internet it takes, and the slower that it's going to be, and the more buffering you're going to encounter. So I'm not even going to mess around with 1080. I've got 400 megabytes per second, but it's I just it just buffers all the time. So I'm going to go down here. It's the second one right here. Uh, you'll click on it. It's going to pull up a a window, and it selects through. If number two didn't work. It'll go down to three, then four, then five, then six, and whatever. And just give it a minute. And the bottom right, it says working. Okay, so that one didn't play. Not a big deal. Go down to three. Click on it. And it went to five all the way to eight. If you run into this, open load stream authorization to play this video, yada yada, just hit cancel. Just hit cancel again. And it will go through. Now we're at 12. 13, 15, 16, 17. And it will go through and it will find a link that will play. Not all movies are going to play. The older ones, uh, they may not play in Neptune. You may have to go to Placenta to find it. Typically they play. I can't guarantee anything. And just like that, you're watching Escape from Alcatraz. Anyway, um, if you want to stop the movie or pause it, press OK. It'll pull up a menu. You can pause it from here. You can also stop it from here. If you if you try to hit the back button while you're playing it, it's going to continue playing in the background. Hit the left arrow key and go all the way down to the bottom where it says full screen. Click on full screen. Now click OK and click stop and there you go now you can use the back key the back arrow key on uh, right next it's left of the home button and just hit back back you can click on year uh, that'll show you all the years um, uh, 2018 some of these movies are brand new. Some of them are not even out yet. Jurassic World, I don't even think it's out yet, but it already listed. Um, just anything you want to watch. Uh, Death Wish, I watched it. It was pretty good. Bruce Willis. Uh, just anything you want to watch. Just click on it. Let it let it go for a minute. Try it out. So you've got 14 1080s, 48 you've got over a hundred streams to stream from so um, 
let it do its thing don't ever rush this thing you can freeze it up if it ever does get froze up just unplug it from its power source give it about 10 seconds plug it back in and you should be good to go just start over again I'm going to start with uh, it's got a lot of 1080s I, I don't like using 1080 They're, they just buffer a lot the quality is phenomenal but if your internet is kind of subpar I wouldn't mess with it so I'm going to go down here to number 15 which is an HD stream and it's working in the bottom right so that means it's doing its thing and there you go there's a buffer right there so even even with that I mean it's, nothing's gonna guarantee it's not gonna buffer um, let me go back and see if we can't select another HD stream um, if it buffers, try you another one. You know, that's all I can tell you. So I'm buffered too. All right. I'm going to click stop and I'm going to go down and select an SD. They're way on down here. So there you go there's some SDs right there alright so that's standard definition that's 480 pixels HD is your 720 and your 1080 is obviously 1080 um, this one right here standard definition should not buffer it may I don't know could be just a movie And I'm going to assume that it's just a movie. Um, there it goes. Anyway, stop it. Just hit stop. So. Basically, it's the same thing on movies, TV shows, whatever. I'll uh, click on that right quick. You can go to networks. You can go to new TV shows, new episodes, whatever genres. Uh, the networks, it'll just show you everything, like all the networks that it pulls from. A&E, ABC, AMC, uh, Animal Planet. These are all just TV shows. So it's got a lot of BBC. So it's got a whole bunch of stuff. CMT, um, it's got all your TV shows. They're all updated. They're the latest, greatest. Every episode is there. Uh, I use new TV shows. That way I can see what's out that's new. All right, these are all new TV shows. Uh, whatever you want to watch just click on it like I said so that's basically Cody in a nutshell works pretty good I'm gonna hit the home button I'm gonna go over here and show you mob draw so mob draw this is what you get I always go to channels uh, for regular channels uh, I'm gonna go into settings right quick into language and select English because I'm English and I like to listen to English stuff so channels is going to be your I'll show you it's your ABC you have HGTV Food Network History History 2 Bravo Sci-Fi TBS Cartoon Network USA A&E Spike AMC TNT CBS HBO HBO Family 
HBO Signature, HBO Everything, PBS, Hallmark, Animal Planet, Nat Geo, Nat Geo Wild. You have Discovery Science, Discovery Investigation, uh, Discovery Velocity, all kinds of discovery, Crime Investigation, Show Times. Uh, you got all your stars. I mean, you can go down here. That's got a ton of stuff. You got BET. So, anyway, you want to watch something? This is all brand. This is all live. So sometimes the channels get mixed up. I don't know how they do. They just do. So if we click on Nat Geo, it might be a baseball game or something. Just click on another Nat Geo. So it's Nat Geo. Many of these sites around the world. Perhaps the most famous is Stonehenge. So this right here is live. This is exactly what's going on right now on TV around the world. So this is live. So this, you just hit the back button. Um, you can watch anything you want to watch. You want to watch HBO? This is what's on HBO right now. It's all live. So it works real good. You're going to get a commercial every now and again. Just hit the back arrow and you'll go back to your channels or whatever. Hit the back arrow again. You can go back. Sports. Let's see here. You can go over here to sports underneath categories. This will be all your ESPNs. So you got ESPN, ESPN2, Pac 12. Uh, you got a lot of British stuff. Um, it'll skip the channels that don't work. You got NBA, uh, Fox Sports 2, CBS Sports Network, BT Sports 2. Uh, you've got NFL TV, which is the NFL Network. So you click on that. It's actual NFL Network. We're live right now. An artist. Has Mr. Lopes pushed boundaries? Okay, it's not. See, this is a good good example. So, NFL Network right now is USA. Can't guarantee everything's going to work. Uh, it should. Fox Sports 1, Fox Sports 2. It's got a ton of stuff in here. Um, your news stations, it's got all of your news. You got ABC, Fox News, all your news stuff. Um, so that's mob drill. All right. You also have Showbox. Showbox I saved for last because it is the most complicated to use. Showbox is very simple platform. If you buy a wireless mouse, I'll send a link. If anyone's interested, I will send a link to purchase a wireless mouse. It has to be Bluetooth. Um, get a mouse and keyboard. I've got one over here. Mine is right here. I don't know if you can see it in here. It's kind of hard to see, but it's a small one. It has a trackpad on it right here and a keyboard. And when it's powered on, it lights up the keyboard. So it works pretty good. That's what I would recommend for Showbox. So we'll click on Showbox right quick. So <clears throat> on your remote, I have included a, uh, a deal called Mouse Toggle. You hit the pause play button twice. And it pulls up a a mouse. I know you can see it on the screen right now. And that is the way to use this without the keyboard. So age, go down here. Everybody knows we're 34. Gender. Uh, we're going to use male. And then we're going to click on OK. Over here. You're going to want up to go to the three lines 
in the top left. You'll go down to movies or TV shows, whatever you're wanting to watch. Once you get over here, I like to put the mouse up there at the top because now you're going to have to get rid of the mouse so that you can scroll through all of your movies. So press the play button once. Press it once again. Uh, slow. And it'll go away. And then you just hit the down key. And then the up key and back down. And then you will be able to scroll through the movies. On here, these are super easy to watch. Uh, Escape Plan 2. Uh, it's got Sylvester Stallone. If you want to watch that, double click the play pause button. Pretty quick. Click, click. There's your mouse. You'll scroll over to, just hold it down. If you go one little click at a time, it'll just go. Just hold it down. You'll just click on that. And you will go over to watch now. If you get an ad, which this does have ads, just go over to the X, click X, and kick back and watch your movie. Give it a minute. When that thing's thinking, it's thinking. 99% of the time, Showbox has phenomenal quality movies. So, what you see is what you get. You want to stop it or pause it, you can just hit the pause play button. And now it's paused. Uh, in order to go back, just go back. Go back again, use the back arrow key, and that's basically it. That's what you can do. So that's movies and TV shows. <clears throat> now I guess for the last thing, I'll show you the Aptio app store. So if you want to use, uh, if you want to download anything, this is where you get it from. They got all kinds of stuff you can get. <clears throat> um, apps they have all entertainment games tools so I click on all these are all the apps you can get for the fire stick I mean there's just tons and tons and tons I mean anything that you want um, I don't know what else you can need but you can probably always figure something out Tune in radio. Click on that. You already you already highlighted on install. Just click install. Scroll down to where it says install. Click install. Sorry, this is all in real time. I don't have any editing software. For some reason, it says app not installed. I don't know why. Probably because it's already on the Fire Stick. But anyway, anything you want, it's on here. Pandora. Pandora Music for TV. Install. Pandora Music for TV. Maybe it'll work. I don't know. I've downloaded apps from here today. So there it is. It's op It's ready to launch. Pandora. It's 
I want you to sign in, log in, click on that, fast login, open a mobile app, blah, 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 enter the code, you're logged in. Boom. Play your music. So that's Pandora. Um, that is what you get. Uh, if you got any questions, feel free to call. And uh, happy fire sticking.